Hello everyone. Today we will be learning basic fillers and the layouts to use them. We begin with a commonly used filler, a combination of spiral and humps. Start from a corner you're most comfortable with. Always make a spiral with a proper dot. Humps need to be very small and neat. Then you can simply finish with a horizontal or vertical line. This being a very common filler, you will find it in everyone's work. So to stand out, you should perfect it. So once you're done with the line, start the next line from here and not from any corner. This avoids any gaps. So guys, when I started with Mehendi, I had this belief that humps need to be done quickly and light. But with time, I learned that it's the exact opposite. Humps should not only be dug but must be done properly, taking its own sweet time. A creative work like Mehendi should not be done in a hasty and uh, careless manner. Art requires time and patience. To do. So to get a good design, an artist needs to be calm, composed and patient. At the same time, don't go at snail speed, but yes, don't rush. Find your rhythm and follow your heart. So you may notice there uh, would be some patches left empty. Now this empty patches which are small is where many may tend to make a mistake. Finding the small patches with the smallest spiral is a very bad idea. Instead, just imagine that you are drawing a similar sized design and only a part of it is getting cropped in the patch. This will bring uniformity in design. The second filler is a combination of circle and hubs. make a circle and then you have to make humps so you can go for two lines or three line variations according to your liking here i'm going with three lines i receive a lot of messages regarding mehendi paste and uh, cone rolling i have already uploaded a video for the same on my igtv and my youtube channel do check the same technique here is the same These two are the basic and very commonly used fillers. Now let's start with another filler. So we're going to start with a spiral again. So draw a spiral. 
two lines or one line and then hums always try to uh, make a line while doing this then make uh, two lines on it one and two hums and then repeat technique in this filler is same as well Our fourth filler is leaf and hums. Draw a leaf, make two or three lines and then hums. You can observe one thing, almost all the fillers includes hums, hence you have to be good at it. If you are not getting it properly, make a guideline like this and then fill it. Just like that. It's done and this is how it looks. Now let's begin with our layout in which we can use any of the filler. Start with drawing two or three lines. Hums.
draw a light line here it shouldn't be dark make sure it's not dark and then let's start with the filling I am going to do zigzag checks in it. You can use any type of grey, the basic fillers which we did. Anything will look nice. Do one side and wait until it dries a bit and then do the other side. So here you can continue with any designs. I am doing flowers and ending it with leaves. Thank you for watching the video. Please like, share, comment and subscribe my channel and stay tuned for more such videos. Bye for now. Keep shining.